On Tribe, Coach Casper here, Coach Justin here. We're going to show you guys tomorrow's uh, movements in our OG workout. Uh, the movement we're going to show you first is going to be that barbell overhead squat. So Coach can uh, power clean that barbell up to his shoulder and then safely bring it to his back. And then from here, widen his hands out wide because it is a wide gripped movement. He'll push press it up, have that overhead. And then from here, make sure he's pushing his hips back, keeping that chest up as he squats all the way into that overhead squat position. Okay, then he'll stand. Now, if we're not yet ready for the overhead squat, coach can actually show us a front squat where we bring that barbell back to the front rack position, elbows remain high, and we can practice the front squat instead if we need to. Now, if we're not yet at the barbell or for the front squats or the overhead squat, we can go to a kettlebell, or kettlebells I should say, and practice a good clean up. From here, he'll hold those kettlebells in the front rack position, practice a double kettlebell front squat. All right, so we got some options. Now the next movement is the handstand push-up. So for those that are not yet quite ready, we can now do a box handstand push-up where we can first place our feet on top of the box, get ourselves in a really piked position with our hips, and then look at the box, touch our head to the ground, and then press through as we do that movement, okay? So that's a box push-up. Or we can even go to the knees and practice a little easier variation of that. Again, of course, we'd have a yoga mat there for coaches' comfortability levels. But those are our movements for tomorrow, okay guys? So let's get after it.